Hi, I'm Mark from easylawnmowing.co.uk and this is the Mountfield SP53 self-propelled petrol lawnmower. In this video, you're gonna learn about all its features and its functions, and by the end of this review, you'll know if this is the right petrol lawnmower for you and your garden. I hope you could see there how easy and quick it was to assemble this uh, Mountfield SP53. There wasn't really any assembly required, just a little bit on the cloth part of the grass box. And all that was required was a spanner just to, to tighten up this uh, clip here on the bar, which holds the recoil pull cord. So that was it. It took a few minutes really to do. Very, very simple. Okay, so let's go and take a closer look at this uh, petrol lawnmower. So let's have a look at the deck on this Mountfield SP53. So Mountfield have uh, opted for a steel deck, which is nice to see on a mower this size. Uh, it's a 51 centimetre cutting width. It has the Mountfield engine on here, which is the ST170, which is 166 cc. And that combination of this deck size, this engine and this grass collection box, this mower is gonna be ideal for lawns up to 2,500 square metres. Let's have a look underneath the deck of this Mountfield SP53. So I'm going to turn this mower on its side, but you're recommended not to do that with your mower. This mower is new, it has no oil or fuel in it. So, so let's have a look underneath and let's see, see what's there. So as I said earlier, it's a 51 centimetre deck size. So this is a large, large deck. And you'll notice at the front here, which is a really nice feature that uh, a lot of petrol lawnmowers don't actually have, and that is an anti-scalping plate. So that's really good to see that Mountfield have included that. You can see here that um, we have the mulching plug in, so this blade is going to mulch your lawn, it has the option to mulch. The mulching plug can be removed if you don't want to do that. So talking about the, the features of this uh, Mountfield SP53, naturally it has the uh, cut and collect, it has the mulching option and it also has the rear discharge. So you'll see here that there is no side discharge on this Mountfield SP53. The wheels on the back of this mower I really, really like. They're 28 centimeters, nice and big wheels. That's gonna give you great stability on more uneven lawns. The tires are even rubber as well. So again, this is living up to Mountfield's uh, excellent standards in terms of quality. There are five cutting heights on this Mountfield SP53. 
and they range from 27 millimeters to 90 millimeters and that really is a very good range for a mower of this size. Another nice feature of this mower is it has a single height adjustment unlike some of the smaller mount fields that have uh, three or some even four height adjustments. This has a single height adjustment that adjusts all four wheels. It's mounted here at the rear and it is really really easy to adjust uh, this mower. So this mower is 34 kilograms in weight uh, so it's really essential to have a height adjustment that's uh, easy to use and as you can see here it is very very simple to use for a height adjust adjustment for a mower of this size so you just simply push in like that and you can adjust the height very very easily of the mower it just locks into the, the settings so let's have a quick look at the grass collection box that comes with this mount field petrol mower uh, it has a solid uh, top here and the base also has a pl plastic sheet so the sides are cloth the advantage of having a cloth sides or cloth uh, grass collection box is that airflow is a lot better with cloth uh, the disadvantages are that they're prone to damage so if you're cutting up against thorny bushes they can get caught and they can get damaged but having said that the material on this collection box is very very thick it's probably the thickest that I've seen on any mower that I've tested so really good quality the other nice thing about having a solid top is that it's going to limit the amount of dust that's thrown up into the operator's face uh, especially if the grass is very dry and very dusty so that's a nice touch. The only negative that I can find with this collection box is there's no full flap indicator on here. So that is missing. So you, you're not gonna know when this grass collection box is full and it needs to be emptied. You're gonna have to do that by the weight of the mower or just the length of time that you've been cutting. So let's have a quick look at the handles on this Mountfield petrol lawn mower. So you'll see that there's two levers. The first one is your operator presence control lever and the other one is your, um, your clutch lever. Uh, so this is for the self-propulsion. So as I said earlier, it's a single speed um, mower. So this is what would drive the mower's rear wheels. So the only thing that I can notice here that, uh, that first strikes me is that there's no foam on this bar. So we'll have a look later when we get the mower started to see what the vibration is like, but it would have been nice if there was a little bit of foam on the top of the bar here. If we work our way down, you can see here that the, the bars can be folded at the central point and they can also be folded at the lower point as well, which is really nice. So these bars will fold completely flat. And there's also uh, a clip here for your recoil starter. So you're not having to bend right down to the engine to start the mower each time. So as I said earlier, this Mountfield SP53 comes with the Mountfield ST170 engine. It's a 160cc four-stroke engine with 3.5 horsepower. So really a substantial engine uh, for a mower of this size, really nice. There is an elite version of this Mountfield SP53 that comes with a Honda engine, but to be honest, for domestic purposes, the Mountfield engine is, is more than adequate. So this is a single speed self-propelled lawnmower, uh, 51 centimeter cutting deck, and it is a recoil start. So there's no electric start with this, this mower. So we need to get the oil in, the fuel in, let's get it started, let's see how well it cuts. So to get your mount field started, you're going to need your unleaded fuel, your oil, your standard four-stroke uh, four oil. So the oil I'm using here is um, an SAE30 oil, and you're going to need about uh, half a litre when this mower comes new. I also like to put in um, an additive or a stabiliser uh, into the fuel because this helps preserve the fuel, especially if you're going to leave fuel in over winter. And it also helps the, the mower to start more easily. Okay, so let's get these in. Let's finally get this started and let's see how well it performs. So we have our oil and we have our fuel in. So let's see how easy this Mountfield SP53 starts. So this is an auto choke 
lawnmower, so there's no uh, choke lever here, there's no priming button. So to start the mower, you simply squeeze on the operator presence control lever, you take up the slack on the recoil starter, and you pull firmly but smoothly on the, on the recoil starter. So let's see whether the mower actually starts first time. Great, mount field starts first time. Let's go and try the mower, let's see how well it cuts. Okay, so I hope you could see there how well this Mountfield SP53 did at cutting uh, the grass there. Um, even on the longer grass, very, very efficient, very nice cut. The mulching ability, so remember this mower has a mulching plug, it has the mulching blade, so you have the ability there to mulch the grass. Incidentally, if you'd like to learn more about the benefits of mulching, you can head over to the easylawnmowing.co.uk website, or there's a link in the description below to an article that I've written about the benefits of mulching. So this mower does have that ability. The height adjustments were really good. The rear wheels being 28 centimeters made this mower very, very easy to maneuver. The anti-scalping plate is gonna be fantastic if your lawn is not level, it's gonna protect the lawn from um, getting scalped. And all in all, a really, really fantastic mower. This mower with the engine, uh, the deck size, the 51 centimeter deck size and the 60 liter grass box, is ideal for lawns up to 2,500 meters square. So quite a large lawn size, medium to large size lawns. As you could see there going up the slope, this is a self-propelled mower. It is a single speed, but going up the slopes was no problem. So you do get a two year warranty, Mountfield warranty with this mower. Uh, the service link uh, organization, Mountfield's service and repair organization is located up and down the country. So you're never gonna have any problems uh, servicing, getting parts for this mower and yeah really all in all you're not going to be disappointed with this Mountfield SP53 self-propelled petrol lawnmower. You can see a full review of this Mountfield SP53 self-propelled petrol lawnmower on the easylawnmowing.co.uk website. I compare this mower to other Mountfield mowers and other brands of mower so you can head on over there and see how this compares with those other petrol lawnmowers. 
If you found this review useful in any way, could I please ask that you click the thumbs up button below this video, it would be much appreciated. And why not subscribe to my channel by clicking the subscribe button again below this video. If you have any questions about this uh, Mountfield SP53, or you have your own experience of this mower, why not put it in the comments box below this video and any questions that are there, I'll be happy to answer them for you. Thanks very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.